Signs of spring include warmer weather, love in the air, flowers in bloom, and the queen hosting her garden parties and getting out her sunglasses. The monarch has been seen everywhere from Buckingham Palace garden parties to the races wearing her eye-catching eyewear, with royal watchers commenting how cool Prince William's grandmother looks when she's sporting her shades. When the queen stepped out for the Epsom races last week, she demonstrated exactly why her sunglasses are not just cool but also practical. Like many grandmothers, the royal knows the value of photochromic lenses, clear eyeglasses that transition to sunglasses when activated by the sun's UV rays. The queen arrived at the Epsom Derby Festival on June 2nd in a cheery lavender suit and hat adorned with red and white blooms, along with her signature accessories, low-heeled shoes, gloves and message-sending leather handbag. The monarch was also wearing her trusty eyeglasses. By the time Her Majesty was in the stands, though, the lenses had tinted, giving her the dark shades look for which she's quickly becoming known. In fact, the Queen's accessories have been especially in focus now that the busy royal month of June, which includes trooping the colour and royal ascot, is well underway. As Buckingham Palace garden party season kicked off in May, Queen Elizabeth was completely prepared for the British weather, wielding an umbrella as well as her signature shades. Earlier this year, Queen Elizabeth was in the headlines not for her own sunglasses, but for those of Anna Wintour. The iconic Vogue editor kept her trademark sunglasses on when she joined the Queen in the front row at London Fashion Week, breaking royal protocol. Etiquette expert Grant Harold, who worked in Prince Charles's household, told the Press Association, Miss Wintour should know that to wear sunglasses when talking to another person, with no medical reason, is unacceptable. She should have removed them before being in the presence of the Queen, let alone in discussion, he added. Eye contact is important while holding a discussion, and not removing sunglasses is the height of bad manners and a serious breach of royal protocol. If the Queen gave her permission to keep them on then that would be acceptable, however this would be unlikely.